specifically the drum majors from this past marching season come in and we um, put together like ABCs. So we go through the alphabet and just like list a fun memory that we've shared this year together. So we're going to start <laughs> by doing the ABCs. So A is for Adam Schofield's Chorky Barking. B is for Blinded by the Sun during the Metamora competition. <laughs> C is for cutoff, which the Trumpets don't understand how to do. <laughs> D is for drill downs, even our last one, because we didn't have time for the senior drill down at rehearsal, we did during class. E is for elemental, the name of our marching show this year. F is for fire, the name of the last movement of the show, and coincidentally, the most fire movement there ever was. <laughs> G is for grapes, the pocket grapes that the trumpet section and other sections sneaked onto the marching band field. H is for what? The word Mr. Landis says that we assume means what. <laughs> I is for ISU, our last competition where all of us together, how bittersweet, but we did score the best ever in U High history. J is for jumping jacks and stopping all together at 10. And then J is also for Jason Landis, our band director. K is for Kenya, where our beloved band director will be doing amazing things next year. L is for the Labor Day Parade, which is arguably the most torturous hour of marching. <laughs> M is for Mother Earth, the first movement of our show. N is for new uniforms coming at you next year. Yeah. O is for opening set. <laughs> P is for the parallelogram set, which I'm sure we all know what we're talking about uh, when we say the parallelogram set because we spent like 10 hours on it. Um, P is also for Punch Your Parents, a synonym Mr. Landis gave us for hitting the folks, which is a dance move in case you didn't know. <laughs> um, Q is for questioning who stole the color guard flags. R is for running the band camp mile that we all dread. <laughs> S is for Sweet Escape, our favorite rehearsal warm-up song. T is for Tuesday night rehearsals and everything that comes with those. U is for uneven spacing and curves. I kind of had a problem with that for a while. V is for very awkward ballet dancing from the low brass during the wind movement. <laughs> W is for water and wind. That's right, we found two words for this one. Those are the second and third movements of our show. X is for extra, even though it doesn't start with an X, just go with it. Uh, the way the clarinets acted when it came to spirit days at band camp. Y is for yardsticks, which were always carried by the most random people during rehearsals. Um, shout out to Dakari and Alex Hess. <laughs> Z is for zombie, which is basically what you turn into by Thursday of band camp. <laughs> and next, we're really excited to um, bring in a new kind of tradition. Hopefully, it becomes one. But um, we're going to do some band superlatives. So basically, uh, we came up with some fun ideas, some fun uh, band superlatives, and we had the whole band vote on them. And so these are the results. Uh, the first one, best laugh is Rowan Scott by a landslide. <laughs> Best dancer was Rosa Nolan. <laughs> Best smile, Sayla Schieber. <laughs> um, Best movie quoter is Amelia Pierce in Adam Schofield. They tied. <laughs> Most talkative, Leelanda Brewer. <laughs> Most likely to get in trouble was Bennett Sinclair. <laughs> the 
chart thing for a second. <laughs> Most inseparable, Nick and his trumpet, he named Tammy. <laughs> Best catchphrase, there were so many good ones, so we chose four of our favorites. Uh, do it for Lando, which everyone said throughout the whole marching season, basically. That's a time for Mr. Rappers. <laughs> Fun fact from Adam Schofield. And Rosa, get to your dot from Mr. Landis. <laughs> the best couple that never dated was Francis and Elliot. <laughs> okay, so we have a little bit of a problem with the best bromance. Um, it turns out Seba uh, matched with two people, so we have Alex and Bennett. <laughs> Section leader, Elena Culbertson. <laughs> the best nickname was Saber Nassar, Sad Boy Saber. Yeah. <laughs> um, biggest ego goes to both the Matts, being Matt Messman and Max Dimitz. <laughs> biggest class clown, Jeff Capron. <laughs> And the biggest drama queen was also Rosa Rollo. <laughs> and last but not least, biggest life of the party, Alex Walbert. <laughs> we also have um, gifts for Mr. Landis and Mr. Sulzberger for everything they've done for us this year, so could we give it up for them? <laughs> <laughs> 